What's up, everybody? Boston John here. Uh, I just got to make a little public service announcement, I guess. <laughs> uh, it's been mentioned to me numerous times that my comedy can be a little brash or very brash and aggressive and shit like that. Look, that's my style, but it's comedy, okay? Uh, when I get into heated debates and shit on Facebook or on social media, I go brash as well. That's just me defending my shit and dealing with reality and using facts to make my arguments. <laughs> I argue against opinions with facts and First of all, if you argue a fact, you're a fucking idiot. All right, so let's just get that straight. But the job of a comedian, uh, stand-up comedian, sketch comics, you know, everybody, as comedians, our job is to take whatever the hot topic in society is and poke fun at it, whether it be fucking Pokemon Go or Donald Trump or Hillary Clinton or Tom Brady or, you know, the fucking disease in, in Rio where they're about to have the Summer Olympics and all that shit, you know. It, it's our job to poke fun at that type of shit, all right? It's not a reflection on our actual religious beliefs and political views. It's jokes, people. It's us creating shit out of shit, you know? Like, whatever the hot topic is, we create ways to make it funny. And everybody has a different style and a different sense of humor. So don't be so fucking sensitive. Lighten up. It's just jokes. But I will say this, and this is me saying this sincerely, not as a joke. If you're offended... Because you play Pokemon Go and you're an adult and you want to go on social media and bitch and moan because people are making fun of you for doing that shit. You're an asshole. Stop bitching and moaning because people are calling you out for acting like a fucking child playing a children's game. Play Call of Duty. Play Madden. You know, do something that, that and there's a reason Call of Duty is mature only 18 and over. And there's a reason Pokemon Go is supposed to be like designed for small children so they don't sit around playing video games and getting fat. It's designed to get them out of the house. Now, given some of you Pokemon players could use the fucking exercise, <laughs> I could use it myself. However, I don't give a fuck. I don't need to go exercising. All right. I got a, I got a woman who takes care of me. I got friends that look out for me, that care about me and love me. I have a good time with life. And you put me on a fucking job site and I can still work circles around half you motherfuckers, if not more. So quit your fucking bitching. It's the job. It's what comes with the territory. And as a comedian, I know we're, uh, sometimes our material is going to piss people off and it's going to upset people because they're wicked sensitive and they don't know how to take a fucking joke. Take it light, man. Lighten up. That's the job. The job is to take whatever everybody's, tr whatever's trending, what everybody's talking about and make fun of it, make jokes about it, yada, yada. So lighten up. Enjoy yourselves. Enjoy the show, man. You know, everything. We all have fun doing it and you have fun seeing it as long as you're not too sensitive and you realize it's just for humor. <laughs> but about the Pokemon Go players crying and shit, that wasn't a joke, seriously. Knock it off. You sound like children. You already looked like idiotic children. Now you sound like it. And you're on social media doing it. And the world sees it. Just stop. Keep playing the game. Have fun. But just stop crying about people calling you out. Especially comedians. Because we're, we're supposed to make jokes about the shit. But anyway, later.